everyone from the entrepreneurs through to the executives that come in from the Silicon Valley through to corporates who also are very interested in what they're doing and, uh, and how they're trying to change the world. So this space is, is collaborative, it gives you permission to work how you want and when you want. When you get that kind of momentum you feed off the other teams around you and, and likewise you can drive value back into the, the community as well. We've got larger teams currently sitting in the space that are up to 35 people so they can flex in and flex out if they need a specific project team that's working from an even larger corporate organisation. The monthly events that we run have just grown to the point where we regularly get over 100 people attending every month. We didn't know whether that was going to happen to start off with but it was clear that people want to actually collaborate and talk to each other. My customers are both corporates and startups, so it was really that good balance and, and just that collaboration in, in the environment. So two guys walk in the door and they end up with six staff and they end up with 10 staff and 12 staff. And in the beginning we weren't able to cater for these guys, we just didn't have the space. And we always dreamt about doing that. And so what we did was we built this larger cluster with bigger offices that could accommodate these larger teams. Our clients and our partners that we have, when they find out we work in a co-working space, are so impressed. They think that it's not only very strategic in terms of what it is that we do, but they're also very intrigued at what it means to be in a co-working space and of course the benefits that that kind of space provides. It's very easy for people to access our events after hours. You know, we target a lot of uh, corporate entrepreneurs who might be thinking about jumping ship. Financially, it's, it's, a, it's a brilliant way to uh, get people in the same space, uh, not only with yourself, but with a larger group of people, um, you know, for a very good price point. We have a large range of different meeting rooms. We've got quiet areas, active areas, social areas, uh, and it's all actually been designed in. We really wanted workspaces that love people. Having lots of um, not-for-profits and social enterprises working around you, it really kind of grounds you. The community feeling as well. It brings people together and it brings businesses together.